After placing matrix implants, attach the long 3D touch impression post to the implants. Insert the long 3D touch impression post using a handpiece set to rotate at 15 RPM. Allow the impression post to align itself without touching it. Print and select the adequate scan bridge in length and angulation. Make sure to use a biocompatible and flexible material such as a crown resin. Brittle materials can lead to fractures of clipping mechanism. Next, attach the first scan bridge to the retention area of the 3D touch impression post, moving towards the neighboring scan body. Continue this process until all scan bodies are connected. Secure the scan bridge firmly to the 3D touch impression post using a flowable light curing composite. This ensures the setup remains stable during the intraoral scanning. Once everything is properly set up, you are ready to begin scanning. Important advice for scanning full arches with ScanBridge. Use a high-quality intraoral scanner by an experienced scanner operator. Use the implant-specific scan workflow. Using non-implant-specific scan workflow can lead to insufficient precision. Attach the scan bridge always from the very first scan. This first scan defines the accuracy of the full arch. You might have to switch off AI functionalities in case the scanner automatically removes the scan bridge. Use a verification jig to check the passive fit for final restorations. For further information, visit tri.swiss or contact our Matrix support team at matrixsupport at triimplants.swiss.